Hi, so in this video, I'm just going to take a quick look at um, how you can encourage some health help, self-help skills um, through play and song. Um, we all know getting children to brush teeth and hair and wash their face can be really difficult. Um, but I do have a, a little song that you can use that perhaps might be able to help encourage that. Get them to copy some of the actions, do it on the teddy, do it on you, do it on them. Um, and that may well then help when you're actually wanting to do that. Um, as part of their getting dressed for the day or getting dressed for bed routine. Um, it also, you can use it to bring in a little bit of that pretend play around some common items such as hairbrushes, cups, spoons, that sort of thing when you're wanting to look at encouraging a little bit more sort of pretend play. So the um, song I'm gonna use is Teddy Bear, Teddy Bear. It's the, the tune of, of Teddy Bear, Teddy Bear, um, but I've changed the words very slightly. So. For this first one, all you need is your teddy bear. You could always substitute it for um, a dolly and you could perhaps say dolly dolly rather than teddy bear teddy bear. So if you haven't got a teddy bear, you could always use a dolly. Um, I've got a hairbrush, a toothbrush and a face cloth. So you'd get your teddy bear and you'd be playing this game with your child. So your child might be sat there with you. And you've got the teddy bear and you show them on the teddy bear what you're going to do. So you go, oh, teddy bear, teddy bear, brush your hair. Teddy bear, teddy bear, oh, wash your face. Teddy bear, teddy bear, oh, brush your teeth. Teddy bear, teddy bear, oh, time for sleep. And you'd sing that song and you'd do it with the teddy bear and then you could perhaps use hand over hand to encourage them to do the action on the teddy bear. So teddy bear, teddy bear, you've got your hand over theirs and you get them to wash the face. You could even try and wash their face, wash your face. Um, so you're doing lots of, of mimicking um, on you, on them and on the teddy bear of the actions you want. So the same with the toothbrush, the hairbrush, um, and do it as a play thing, a playtime thing, activity, something really nice to do. That real sing-songy feel to it makes it feel like they're actually playing a game, but they're doing all those things you need them to do. They're thinking about a hairbrush brushing the hair and toothbrush brushing the teeth and a cloth that washes the face. So as I said, you can also do this with things like food and that. So I've got here a bowl, a cup and a spoon. Um, so you could simply do, <gasps> sit there and go, oh, teddy bear, teddy bear, drink your juice. <gasps> teddy bear, teddy bear, <gasps> eat your food. <gasps> teddy bear, teddy bear, <gasps> oh, use your spoon. Teddy bear, teddy bear, you'll be finished soon. So again, you're demonstrating with the teddy bear. Let's give teddy bear a drink. Let's give teddy bear some food. So again, you can then start encouraging your child and saying, oh, would you like to give teddy bear his juice? That's it, give teddy bear a drink. Um, would you like a drink? You pretend to have a drink. Oh, mummy, have a drink. Teddy bear, have a drink. Um, so using from that song, using all of those actions, you can start to build up on that pretend play but also again, looking at them actually using skills that they themselves could use to help feed themselves, have a drink, brush their teeth, wash their face, making them become more familiar to them um, and something that is part of a, a song they do as opposed to something we're imposing upon them to do. Um, so I hope that helps a little bit if you're kind of struggling with a little bit of that kind of pretend play or even, you know, getting them to use spoons, brush hair, wash face, brush teeth. Um, it really does help an awful lot. As always, um, if you've got any lovely videos of your children doing these little um, actions, we'd really love to see them.